We're here to explore the role of policy in critical infrastructure resilience. The Resilience Shift has supported a number of grantees to answer a number of questions about the role of policy in critical infrastructure resilience. We heard some of their early findings um, and got feedback from a range of stakeholders in government, industry and academia on what they think um, can help us moving forward in the area of policy. The engagement we had from the audience and the chance to sort of view that big picture and discuss it was, was really valuable. The message that kept on coming through a lot of the presentations, a lot of the discussions is there's no silver bullets. There's a lot of things that need to be in place and we've got some great examples of what different people are doing in different parts of the value chain and we just need to sort of create that bigger picture so that we get resilience from sort of beginning through to operation and maintenance of infrastructure projects. We're very fortunate to have a number of brilliant actors in this space to help us um, embed the principles and the values of resilience thinking into all communities, um, the, the business side, the government side, the community side, where they meet in the middle for action and action for our clean future. For me it's about uh, transparency and sharing of information. The role of government is a complex one, um, but government needs to be able to provide that safe environment and certainty to the community about its long-term planning, about the resilience of its infrastructure and about um, community well-being. The work that's been done today by the Resilience Shift provides a fantastic base but there's a whole range of areas that need further exploration and we're really still just at the start of a journey in terms of embedding resilience within critical infrastructure. You know, we don't want to reinvent a wheel in the UK that's already been thought through in Australia and vice versa so I think that was the that was the hope that I had that there'd be some great knowledge here to share more widely and I think it's been confirmed by what we've learned.